Hey y'all, welcome back to another episode of the Golden Impact. Yes, Ruby's back again. If this is your first time tuning in, definitely hit that subscribe button. And if you've been a loyal member, loyal subscriber, welcome back. I hope y'all enjoyed the last episode of our auto detailing group. But this episode, we're going to get a real buttered up feeling, okay? You're probably like, ooh, butter, what we cooking? Ooh, you don't know, but you will know in 2.5 seconds. You know why? Because we have a CEO in the building. I'm talking about owner, founder of it all, ever bless you. So, hey, my name is Ashley Hendrick, and I am the CEO and the founder of Ever Bless You. And so welcome, Ashley. Thank you. Thank you for having me. Absolutely. And so just a little behind the stories, me and Ashley actually met at a pop-up shop. Mm -hmm. um, the recap. I'm sure y'all seen the recap. If you haven't, I'll drop the link below. But we met at a pop-up shop, and I loved the presentation. I just needed a butter. I needed something to get on my skin to get me right. I love the thickness. I was getting too many thin lotions from Victoria's Secrets. God knows where. <laughs> just know. It was like, you know, the Christmas presents where you get the little mm. packs and everything. It was just, it wasn't working. It wasn't working. It wasn't doing anything. At all. And so you already know, I went up to Ashley talking to her at least 10 minutes left. <laughs> Came back for another 10 minutes. And we figured something out. So I'm just really excited for y'all to get the opportunity that I already have. And so with that being said, Everblessed Beauty, how did you come up with the name? Well, actually, the name Everblessed Beauty stems from a nickname that I created for myself. Okay. Which is Everblessed Ash. That's my actual regular personal handle. Okay. Everblessed Ash. But I created that nickname because I feel like I would always be blessed. Wow. Like, I have that tattooed on me. Like, right. I'm big on that. Um, I'm not religious, but I'm a spiritual, spiritual person. Spiritual, yeah. And so I just felt like I will always be blessed. And I wanted that to transfer onto my business too. Absolutely. You y'all know what we get into here. If the praises go up, then the blessings come down. And okay, so let's keep mm -hmm. going. Now, with Ever Blessed Beauty, how are you really helping the community with what you do? So my ultimate goal with my business was to help people feel more confident. Mm. So I felt like I wanted to be an entrepreneur and I was like, what is it that I really want to do? What is it that I care about? What right, is it that right. makes me feel good? And I actually literally went through my bank statements to figure out what it is that I spend the most money on. What do I like to do? That's bad time. And, and it's literally <laughs> self-care. Like I really liked to try like new oils and body washes and everything like that because it makes me feel good right exactly. you know i love to feel clean i love to feel like taken care of right and heads and toes. right so i was like okay i'm just gonna go for it that's amazing and now you're helping other people feel the exactly. exact same way so i that's exactly what i wanted to do like men and women i cater to both men and women right. and i just want them to feel good and as well, use something that's actually healthy for your skin. Right. So my products smell really good, but they actually work because I had a, a big science background mm -hmm. from school. I went to school originally to be a doctor. Wow. So I took a whole bunch of science classes. Mm -hmm. And then I tried to really incorporate my knowledge from that into my business. So you went to school to be a doctor. I mean, what is that journey looking like for you now? Or are you... I still take classes from time to time, but right. I really wanted to focus on up my business too, because mm -hmm. that's where my passion is. Okay. Yeah. And so being that that is where your passion is and where it lies, I mean, we if you take a look on her Instagram, you'll see that she kind of started with lashes and such. So how did it really go from the lashes and the perfume to now body scrubs, body oil, body butter? <laughs> so when I first started, I started as a makeup artist. I'm actually still a makeup artist. Wow. So I was like, if I invest in the lashes and I start to sell the lashes, then I can't really lose. Right. You know, like right. I, either I will sell it individually or I'll sell it within my makeup packages. Right. Exactly. Right. So that was kind of me taking like a step into the business entrepreneurship right. realm. Mm -hmm. And then I started to get a little bit more comfortable. And then I started doing me. Okay. <laughs> so you kind of found your habitat within, right. oh, wow, sure. the beauty industry. Right. Beauty, sure. beautiful. Y'all see us? Okay. okay. <laughs> <laughs> and so, I mean, with all the creations that you do have on your Instagram, I mean, at least from the reels to the videos, just seeing everything that you create, it does take a lot of time, I feel like. For sure. And so with that being said, like, 
is all of your time solely ever blessed beauty or do you have other hustles other hobbies other things coming up let the golden impact know okay i have <laughs> i have a lot of projects that i work on okay. um on a regular basis and i have things that i've been working on for years that just nobody knows about yet uh, but um i am a makeup artist still right and I am actually going back into acting. Mm. So when I was younger, I did it, but I couldn't continuously do it. I went to a convention actually, and I got like chosen for a contract in LA, but I couldn't move to LA at the time by myself. Right. I was like a kid. Yeah. So now I'm like, that's, you know, like that was my first love. Mm -hmm. So I'm going back into that and I'm pursuing it, but I'm not gonna let the business go down. Though. Right, exactly. So I'm, I'm still gonna make it work and invest into my business and expand okay yes, and so do. that's amazing only because it will only evolve each hustle that you have each right. passion and elaborate everything you want to do mm -hmm. look at the dreams coming true, true. Ah, that's so <laughs> and so i see that you're saying the acting and now um never letting ever blessed beauty go why because it's blessed forever period so what can we look forward to when it comes to ever blessed beauty is there any expansion any things on the up and up when it comes to that business for sure um, I am currently working on pushing into stores. Uh -huh. So I want to get into stores. Um, I just want to rebrand and I'm going to relaunch. I'm going to relaunch and rebrand. I've been working on it for quite a while. Mm -hmm. And then I've been working on getting mass production going so mm -hmm. I could really push it out and really do things the right way, exactly the way I want them done. Yeah. And just expand. Yeah. Just really expand um and make the product more accessible. You sound so confident in everything and I really love it. Like <laughs> it's the energy. Like how did you I mean for people at least watching, how did you really get to the point where you are now? It sounds like you are on the path to success in you. Yes. Um it I, it took a lot of self reflection. Mm. It took a lot of getting over like self doubt. Wow. Um it, it was a journey. Yeah. You know, like it, a lot of self work. Yeah. You know, constantly working on yourself and correcting my mindset. Mm. Um, whenever I had like any doubts I had to fix myself, like, hey, you know, come that right back. Come <laughs> <out. You know? laughs> You see what I'm saying? Every time you feel discouraged or you feel like giving up, you gotta yeah. every time you and this is just kinda of hard because it's like you can't anticipate it. It's like this month you might do everything you're used to doing and you're not gonna do as well. But right. then the next month you might it might go up. You right. see what I'm saying? Some people can't handle that. Right. It's not a stable environment. Absolutely. But it's an environment that fits me and suits me and I love it. And you work in it. Okay. Together. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Building every episode. Drop your comments if you're enjoying the channel, guys. Drop your comments if you enjoy the Golden Impact. Drop your comments if you feel in every episode and you have been at least helped, inspired, or just seen beautiful people come through these doors. I mean, we're so excited for everything that we have on the up and up. But now, slowly coming down from the climax for Everless Beauty, we do have some news that y'all may not know about or a few people may know about. We hear there is some transporting, moving, traveling on the way. <laughs> and so, where are you going? Why are you leaving us? Oh, stop me. <laughs> you making me feel bad. No, but... don't feel bad, but like, feel bad a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> I am going to Atlanta. I am moving to Atlanta with the hopes and the dreams of expanding my business Absolutely. and pursuing my acting career for sure wow so yeah it'll be i'm a little nervous i'm not gonna lie right but i'm more excited than anything for a new chapter of my life new journey new yeah, start exactly brand new mm -hmm. that's exciting well the golden impact wishes you all the best thank you absolutely thank you so much and so with that being said now, is there anything that you would like to let our audience know, our subscribers, the community know, not only before you go, but before you, you know, start a new chapter in your life? Um, I would like to let the community know that Everblessed Beauty is going on the map. Follow us. And I, I would like nothing more than for you guys to join me on this journey. Absolutely. Right. So I'll be very vulnerable very transparent about the journey coming up mm. and uh just tune in with me 
Absolutely. And where can we find you? Where can we follow you? What is your main platform? My main platform is Instagram at Everblessed Beauty and YouTube. The YouTube's going up. Oh. Okay. Yep. So Everblessed Ash on YouTube. You can follow me personally on Everblessed Ash. Um, that's all my platforms: TikTok, Twitter, Instagram. Everything's Everblessed Ash. Wow. Okay. Mm-hmm. Well, look forward to all the new follows because guess what? The community is tapping in. Hello. And so the fact that you said you're going to Atlanta, I mean, that's a big ordeal. You know, a lot of people have been moving to Atlanta. It's getting real hot up there. Yeah. I mean, what really motivated you to go to Atlanta and not to like LA, like where you got the offer from? Right. So in Atlanta, it was like uh, killing two birds with one stone. Mm. So I was originally getting casted in Atlanta. Wow. See what I'm saying? So I had to fly back and down, like back and forth. Already? Already. Okay. To do the castings in Atlanta. And I started to form connections mm-hmm. with um some of the casting directors and people there and other actors and actresses. Mm-hmm. And um, I just feel like it's a great place for my business. Yeah. And I think I would get a lot of love and support out there too. I, I feel like I did really well in New York. Right. And I have customers right. in Atlanta already. Right. So um, I just want to go out there and just expand, work on expansion and work on collaboration for the expansion. Exactly. And I feel like there's more collaborative opportunities down there. Okay. Yeah. And so everyone in Atlanta, tune into this. Y'all tune into the video already, but make sure y'all welcome my girl Ashley, okay? Yeah. Y'all lucky we giving her from New York. I'm telling y'all, if y'all hear her clients up, I know they're going to be like, y'all lucky. Y'all real? Matter of fact, y'all blessed. <laughs> not luck it's always about the blood hello and so with that being said once again travel and mercies of Thank course you. wishing you the best um but we are really excited for you and now being a part of the community we can only see you going up right yes. guess what we together hello on the journey hey, we're coming up right. we're, all coming up. we're on the direction <laughs> <No>. hello <laughs> <laughs> and with all that being said, y'all, we want to thank you for tuning in once again. Y'all know another episode will be up the very next week. And with all of that being said, wishing Ashley traveling mercies, a great experience, and only a better platform for everybody's beauty and yourself, quite frankly. I mean, is there any advice or anything you can give to maybe young ladies watching or entrepreneurs wanting to do the same thing that you've done? <laughs> Um, yes, um, I would say if you have an idea, if you have a passion, put it out there. Don't wait for it to get perfect Mm. before you put it out there. Put it out there, go for it and correct it as you go. Mm. So when I first started my business, there were certain skills that I didn't have. There were certain resources that I didn't have. I started my business only with like $600, Mm. right? So I had to learn how to do graphic design. I had to like, all my labels I created myself. I created the products myself. There was some research that I had to invest, but slow and steady, you know? Right. So just don't stop yourself. Mm -hmm. Put yourself out there and then continue, continue. You're going to get criticism. You're going to get this. You're going to continue. You're going to get better. Just know you're going to get better with time. Right. Oh, only time will tell. I love that. That was great. And y'all already know we post on Instagram, progress, not perfection. Mm-hmm. That's exactly what it says. Mm-hmm. We're going to be back again, but I want to thank you again for coming out. Thank you for having me. Absolutely. I really appreciate you guys. Yes. Make sure you subscribe. Y'all already know the usual. We love the TLC, especially with the Everblessed Beauty. I'm telling y'all, y'all need the glow. It's a must. It's a must. But the SOC is what we thrive off of, what we need to keep y'all invested, to keep y'all interested, to know that this is where the community is not only branding from or as a platform, but to know that it's building every day, stronger, each and every day, each and every product, each and every client, each and every viewer, each and every subscriber. So definitely, definitely, definitely subscribe, like, comment, and y'all already know. Bang that bell for the next episode. We'll see y'all real soon.